one's for all the ladies. As you know from the title, tonight is Ladies Night. So this video is going out to all the ladies who are wondering a list of ways to get a guy to like them. But not the kind of guys that won't respect you. These are the top 10 ways to get guys to like you that will actually respect you as a person that's unique and special and not anything else besides that. So here we go. 10 ways for the ladies to get the guys to like them. Practice modesty. Modesty is one of the most important things. And I'm not just talking about clothing, but I will make this one point. Guys are more comfortable with ladies that will at least wear shirts that are way down past the belly button. And if he does think that's normal, just don't pick him. I mean, you guys probably wouldn't be very comfortable if I showed my belly to you guys while I was talking. But I'm not even talking about modest clothing. I'm talking about modest selves. You need to be able to be humble and comfortable in your own skin at the same time. You don't want to get too comfortable in your own skin so that you are bragging all the time. I mean, no one likes hearing this. I'm the awesomest person ever, and I'm going to get all the girls because I do and say everything right. Practice respect. Look girls, if you want the respectful guys to like you, you have to respect the respectful guys. Because girls, the right guy will feel like dirt if you're just using him to make yourself look cool in front of the other girls. Encourage him. Girls, this is the terrifying truth, but most guys don't really like clothes shopping. But let's say you and your crush are going out to shop for clothes, and the guy actually makes an effort to enjoy himself. Wouldn't that make you just feel so happy? So if he makes an effort to enjoy himself on something you enjoy, but he doesn't really enjoy, encourage him. Because guys love hearing encouragement. Even if it's the smallest thing, like, you know, I really appreciate you making an effort to enjoy yourself. Be bold in the talk. The most terrifying part of your crush is talking with them about it. But be bold in it, or else you're going to regret even, well, not being bold. Guys want to have their information given straight to them. That's why they don't like studying very much, because they just want their information straight to them so that they can pass the tests. But I'm not talking about school. I'm talking about love here. So just be bold. All you have to do is come up to him and say, hey, I really like you. It's that easy, and the awkward stuff is optional. Don't say that you like him through a text or through a Facebook message or through a friend. Tell them face to face. Because guys will really, really like it if you tell them face to face. Do not stalk him. And I'm not even talking about real life stalking. I'm talking about any kind of stalking ever. I mean, when I have a Facebook account, I'm just hoping and praying that no one is going to stalk me. Which probably won't happen because I'm not that popular. And I'm glad about that. Because if someone was stalking me, well, it might not work. Embrace your differences with the guy. Ladies, you will have differences with the right guy. Everyone has differences. They were created differently. Remember that romance is not like in the movies. Ladies, you probably see a lot of movies with romance in it, but it just goes way too far, way too fast. And by way too far, I mean kissing within 30 minutes of the entire movie. That makes no sense, and it's not realistic. So don't take it too fast, and don't make it feel like it's in the movies. Because at least the right guys won't go around saying, You know what I'm going to do? What are you going to do? I'm going to elevate me and Evelyn's friendship as quickly as they do in the movies. Man, that sounds like a great idea. Yeah! Yeah! Don't take guys' chivalry for granted. Ladies, the right guy will want to be chivalrous. She'll want to do things for you, like opening the door and pulling out that chair so that you can, you know, sit on it. So don't take it for granted, because then you'll just be bossy. Oh, what am I going to do? She's telling me to do a bunch of stuff, and I don't even know how to do some of them. Maybe if I just hide, she won't ask me to do anything anymore. I mean, I just want to do stuff for her at will, but against my will and things I can't do? This is just too much for me. I gotta hide. Ah! I think that's a pretty accurate description of what will happen if you're bossy. Don't 
be a click brain. Lots of girls and guys struggle with being a click brain. You may not know what a click brain is, I bet a lot of you don't know, because I actually made this word up. A click brain is this person that treats love like a switch in their brain that they can turn on and off whenever they want to. In guys case, it'd be like this. Ooh, I really like that girl. Oh, no, wait, I don't like her anymore. Oh, what about that girl? Oh, no, it's she's too lame. Um, ooh, what about that girl? She's really pretty. Oh, no, she already has a boyfriend. Um, click, 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 click. Being a click brain is the rough definition of telling a guy. You're pretty much like every single guy in the entire world, and they're all the same, so you're not even special. Don't be confusing. Ladies, like I said before, guys like their information handed right to them. So don't be confusing and try to make them figure it out themselves. It's too confusing! And then the guy will just end up giving up on this entire puzzle. So don't be confusing, because if you are, it's gonna go like this. I don't know if she likes me or not, because she and a lot of other people have given me hints that she likes me, but she and a lot of other people have also given me some hints that she might not like me. And if she does like me, then why is she hiding these things from me and giving these hints that she might not like me? Oh, this is so confusing. I'm not even sure if this is gonna work. Is this gonna work? Or should I just give up forever? <sighs> so girls, there you go. The top 10 ways to get the respectful and right guys to like you. From a guy's perspective, I would like these things in a girl. And I bet the right guy will like these things in you too. Boom, 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 boom